afternoon here in Central Florida, and it just got out to my stand. And look how beautiful this is. Man, I love hunting different terrain. This is so different from what I'm used to in Iowa. And I'm really thankful for my buddy, Mike Rosa, who invited me to come out here and hunt hogs with him, and then Tyler Benson, who joined us as well. It didn't take long at all for the hogs to start coming in. A little after 3 p.m., all these shoats just started pouring in and they were just going after the corn and eating it up. And I was waiting for a big sow because I knew there had to be a sow in this group somewhere. I was waiting for her to come out. And so I let them just stay and mingle for a long time till they had about eaten all the corn. And I, I still hadn't seen a sow or a big boar. And so I just decided to go ahead and put the hammer down on one of them. And then, man, it got really crazy at that point. Okay, that was a pretty small hog, but this big game three broadhead sure made quick work of it. Gosh, check this out. In most of these shots, the only reason the arrow didn't go all the way through is because it, it hit the sand on the opposite side and that stopped the penetration. I was just about to get down from my stand and go follow the second hog that I shot. It ran into these thick palmettos and something caught my eye. And I don't know if you can see it. It's right below my broadhead here from my GoPro. It, it's a lighted knock that I'm using. I'm testing it right now by D-Power. They have this new model and it's flashing. <laughs> and that made the tracking a whole lot easier because it's actually in a different direction than it ran into, into the palmettos. exciting i mean two in just a matter of seconds what an incredible hunt i am so thankful for my buddy mike taking me out there and i actually even got a six hog but it was too dark for camera light so i didn't get any images or film of that and i shot that one with a tooth of the arrow xl solid one of those new ones and it performed really well actually all of the heads performed exceptionally well i think i was probably most impressed with the, uh, the big game three on this one because it just packs such a wallop and makes such an impressive hole. And you can look in the description box. I have discount codes if you're interested in, uh, in getting any of these heads. You can save some money by using my discount code. But what an incredible hunt. Thanks for watching.